So we're about to bring it home. Stay tuned. I'm really proud of you. Thank you, sir. How's a gutsy performance out there tonight? He took us to a national championship when nobody, and I mean nobody, expected you to. And for what it's worth, I'm really glad you stayed four years ago. Thanks, Coach. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, baby, we going to the chip. Whew. One more game, baby. We got this, man. Oh, yeah. Football is my life, man. But you got to stay grounded in what's important. So I got a little surprise for you. Isaiah! <laughs> Em, looking good, Emily. Oh, and I'm loving this hat. Thank you. Oh, absolutely. Is that magenta? Fuchsia? What color is that? <laughs> okay. Hey, I bet he'd probably be good at uh, off the board, huh? Yeah. Look, Emily has the best games. Okay. If you had a unicorn, would you want its mane to be purple or pink? Well. Hmm. Well, these are both tough, but good options. I think I'm gonna have to go with purple. <laughs> purple. <laughs> <laughs> what? No, look. <laughs> you see, look, you don't, you don't pick from the options given, all right? The game is in the name, off the board. Yeah, now it's clicking. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, look, if I had a unicorn, I'd have a mane that matches his horn. Silver. Mm -hmm. I'd go with Onyx. Ah, Onyx? <laughs> okay. I told you, she's a pro. <laughs> hey, how are you? Todd Atwood. I'm Emily's dad. Hi. Can I talk to you for a second? She's too shy to ask, but Emily wanted to know if you could do something for her in the national championship game. Yeah, of course. Anything. She wanted you to throw three touchdowns. Three? I thought I said four. Four touchdowns? <laughs> oh. <laughs> is, is that okay? Uh, well, four touchdowns is a lot. <laughs> uh, yeah, but how can you turn down this face? Look at that. But I'll see what I can do. Yes! Don't, don't worry. He'll do it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> it's good to see you again. It's nice to meet you, Emily. You too. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got here. We're days away from the national championship game, and there is one big question on everyone's mind. Can lightning strike twice? Last week, we saw a quarterback with no game day experience lead his team to victory in the college football playoff semifinal. Kyle, is this kid good enough to win a championship? Nah, not, not at all. It, no, no, not that's no. it. But hold on. I don't think he has to be. And this, let me tell you what I mean. There is so much talent on that team on both sides of the ball. Manage the game. Don't make the big mistake. I think they have a real shot. I do. Kyle, we don't like managers of the game here at this table. Very boring, just like your shirt. I feel you, but I disagree. The team has a ton of talent. But they're going to need this dude to make some plays. They're not going to win if they hand the ball off 50 times. You two be nice. You, Peter Schrager, mm -hmm. do you think he'll rise to the challenge? I do, as, as long as the pressure doesn't get to him. Yeah, for real, he's about to feel that pressure. Listen, there's a lot of weight on this dude's shoulders right now. He wins this game, he punches his ticket to the NFL. He loses, and psh, we'll see, I guess. And then if you're a coach, how do you handle this? Mm. What do you say to a kid that has so much to lose on that field? Hey, can I talk to you a minute? Are you sure, coach? You know, I know it's hard to shut out all the noise. It's a lot of pressure. The only thing that we can control 
is what's right in front of us. And what's right in front of us is a game of football. Same rules as always. So you gotta take a step back. All right? You gotta breathe it in. You find a way to appreciate this moment, this, this time with your teammates, take in the crowd. Man, you do that, and, and everything gets real quiet. All right? So breathe. Take it in. Trust me, I know what I'm talking about. I got you, Coach. Yeah. Thanks. Go. Yeah. Yeah. Crown a champion tonight here at Levi Stadium in Santa Clara for the college football playoff national championship game. As we'll see the Florida State Seminoles taking on the Texas Longhorns. Yo, I can't send One these game kids. to decide it all. It's the college football playoff national He's championship. And off we go from I'm Levi's athlete. Stadium. Like, this hey, is taken I'm at the sick. three. Can you give me four touchdowns? Yeah, nice work on the return. Like, yeah, sure, start but drive. have you spoken to my offensive the line? line? Have you talked to my receivers to see how they're going to be playing today? You know? Are you sure them off as a line of box me like they need to? So I can stay in this pocket and as the get out one touchdown? Like some Here's these requests are ridiculous. And they're talking and to the wrong people for like that. Physical play on the football there. No, she needs to talk to my offensive line first. She needs to talk to the offensive really player first. She needs to talk to the offensive player first. She needs to talk to my wide receiver to see. Are their feet work? Is their feet work right today? No? They're going to do what they need to do? You know, so many requests. Back to throw just, now on second and ten. Steps oh, away to his left. LeBron James, you're my favorite it. player. Can you drop 61 points today? I know their defense is really good. That was an excellent job of recognizing the, the situation. His but you have to get 61 points today. Heck, his second read wasn't there. there. But he bought Mike, himself a little extra out time here. scrambling out of the pocket. Got to the sticks Let's and get picked up the game. first down. He'll look to throw. Little underneath throw into the hands get to of Walker. Touchdowns. That throw goes for four. It's second down. It ain't going to be for him. Well, they were unable to make it's anything really punch my big ticket. out of that. But it's not a bad idea to find your tight end and give him an easy completion and keep moving go, things forward. Go. Almost that as bread and butter as a good running Maybe. back dive play. Hey, Just in case. Second and six. Ooh. Rolling to his right. Ooh. Oh, he's got a man wide open. Complete. He'll get this one down the 20-yard line. Just shy just, of the 20. Good yardage yes. after the catch. Is that play good for 30 and a first? See them over the game looking at the team. They give the slay here. They had nowhere to run on the interior of that defensive line. He'll get back only to the line of scrimmage. And the big fella stuffed that one up in a big way. I think doubling him has to be a priority because you can't move up to the next level if you don't take care of him first. Now he'll look to throw Damn. here on second and ten. No, I think he's going to take it. Sack back of the 29. Sheets wide open two in the corner. Great job and defensively. I think he'll establish himself to start a game. That has to feel pretty good for Being them. Being a quarterback, the don't play a defense. Three first downs and three probably points. Probably never want to do the defense. The Seminoles but here with a first and ten. The series, They'll run now with Will Hoyt. And he's not going anywhere to start the night. They stop him at the line of scrimmage. He's not going anywhere to start the night. No gain Let's on the play there. Way. Second down. So they had the run for no gain. Now they'll try again from the 25 on second and 10. On the ground with Cox. And from the 25, they worked this to the 29 and a gain of four. I passed defense so little shit. Florida State, they're Always seeking their fourth national championship. I they were winners back in 1993, defense. also in 99, and then most recently back in 2013. To throw on third down. George. He throws and he hits the slant route to Thomas. Come on now. Let's go. When you give up points on the opening drive, in this case a field goal, you'd hate to go three and out. They avoid that. They do, and it's also walking that fine line mentally too as a coach, isn't it? Because you get want to emphasize to your team exactly what you said. All right, we gave up a field goal. Let's go back and at least equal that, guys. I just said my corners had been a lot now. You don't want to feel like the it's the end of the world either. Nice that they were able to pick up the first down there, help them relax a little bit. Now Will Hoyt. 
to him. Muscle his way up to the 43 for a pickup of right around five. A quick burst there, and he nicely bit off a pretty decent game. We should even expect to go. Go. On third down, George. And Thomas has it. And he's got the first down yardage before being taken down at midfield. Give him seven yards on the play as they do pick up Safety the third down number. conversion. It is 82. On the carry, this is Will Hoyt. And forget about finding a lane. He barely had time to look up before he was planted in the backfield. That'll wind up going for a loss of four. And it'll bring up a second and 14. Three nothing after one on EA Sports. Regularly passing, so let's get straight to it. They'll run it now out of the gun. Good me. Good me the drop play. And that'll be good for eight yards to the 45. I uh, yeah, uh, second it is. It's really nice to see an offense that has enough confidence to, to run the football in that there. situation. I think that goes back to their practice and game planning. They've seen things that they've seen on tape and in previous games that led them to believe that even in a long distance situation, they can still run the football and gain enough yardage to put themselves in a good spot on third down. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. And this time, not quite to the 30. It'll be down at the 31-yard line. It's a six-yard gain on the ground, and that'll make it second and four. That's a one one series of defense. That's a long series, ain't it? Off play action. George. And he's going to go down here. A sack. They push him back to the 34. Almost two yards. Yeah, we talk about players blitzing all the time. I often laugh and sometimes call it just straight ahead pursuit. What a running start right back to the backfield for him. Yeah, we really didn't give anybody a let's chance go. to get up there. Maybe that's the way they should look at it. All right, let's get this touchdown. Well, not this time. We need four from the bad boys. About so set for their next out. drive, oh, the Texas on. offense at the line. And quick. after the field goal last time, we'll see what they can get here. At least they got points out of the last drive, Charles. I never met an offensive dude. coach that didn't want to drive to end with a kick. <laughs> Most Terrible of them want to end with a PAT, right? In this case, a field goal, they'll take it. Way better than the alternative, which is a punt. Yeah, but you've met fan bases that wanted that, <laughs> that weren't happy with that field goal. I haven't met a fan base yet that wants to drive to end with a kick, <laughs> other than the extra point. That's it. Now he dumps this off over the middle. So we end up getting 10 back as that sets him up for third down. The last catch nearly got him a first, but it did not, and they'll try to convert on third and inches. Uh, just in case. They'll look to throw. Flushed out right. Got it. And this is going to be caught. He won the fight for the football. This first catch, and it's a pretty big one. They get the conversion on third down. The Longhorns come up first and ten. They'll set up a throw. His throw incomplete. Come on, Neil. Defensively, Charles, they continue to really limit this offense as far as yardage goes. Yeah, you're exactly right. They've been assignment sound, staying in their lanes, keeping proper leverage, and communicating well, too. He'll drop to throw. And this time he's got the hookup. It's complete. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. That one, a gain of 20 and a first down. Slap person. Complete. It's Sparks. And down Sparks inside man the 15, shy of the 10. A good gain again. That's now 31 yards combined on those last two plays. This is not be off the ball, I see. Now a throw to the end zone on first down, but it winds up incomplete. It's been my observation. There's been a nice variety of I play calls on the defensive line. You and I often talk about an offense's so ability to keep the defense off balance with what they're doing. I think the Congress has been true in this game. Oh. That is caught for a Longhorns touchdown. A 12-yard touchdown. He can't his speed. And his guys have He's taken the lead. Ready, break. Eight seconds left. Rebound, 132 fighter. 
They'll come out throwing here on first down. Throwing the out route incomplete. That's Sparks. Still a few inches short of a first down as they come up now on second down. I don't see why not. They'll throw now on the final play. He's going to walk one that. deep That's left side good. here. That's oh, caught inside the 20. What a story this would be. Texas one and a half away from a national championship. Man, better in the second half, all right? What? Just give me the ball, all right? Let me do my thing. I agree. Got it. Hey, you know how much this means to me, right? Of course I do. Then make it happen. Okay, man. I'm gonna be honest with you, I forgot what his name was. I don't even know what number he is. Is he Streets? Or is he Shaw? No clue. They'll try and start this drive in the <sighs> air. Oh, incomplete. A turnover would have like really helped there. Almost intercepted. Instead, it's just second down. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and ten. Looking to throw. Get my name get down up past the 15 yard line. Nothing open downfield. He keeps right, so it himself. Really you never get a sack doing. from the O line's perspective. Hey, they hate it for several reasons, especially because they felt like they let little brother down back there in the pocket. Oh, no doubt. They have a ton of pride, and they go into every job wanting to keep that guy clean. They want that uniform with no grass stain. And this yeah. is caught. And Look at that foolishness. Short down at the one yard line. It went over the head. That sets up a first and goal. Right, Here's the Longhorns it. now on first and goal. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw toward the end zone, but that's going to wind so up mad right incomplete. Now, but I definitely did not mean to press. Did have a receiver open downfield as it turned out. Couldn't even find his outlet. Wasn't trying to throw to him at all. Way too tight. Unable right, to find anyone on you. Second and one. That is caught for a Longhorns touchdown. Let's go. From a yard out. And the Longhorns add on to that lead. Quarterback fumble. Right. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. And he'll hit his tight end, Walker. And he will be taken down. But we can get two more touchdowns. We can do it. It's going to be the final play of the third quarter. We can get done. Back now here on EA Sports. They go play action here on first and down. Stop being scary. As we've got the final quarter upon us. We get ready to start the fourth. And he's going to be down at the 35. Much. Game of seven. USC Reggie Bush. Another nice pick up through the air. And I think a lot of people might expect him to run the ball in this situation, Brandon. But run the ball. This, though, what you're hoping is that you figure it out and you see and get a clue that maybe there's going to be some pressure Let's coming go. out. Let's go. You change the blocking schemes. Maybe you go to max protection. The biggest one is right. maybe you bring your running back in to try and keep you clean. But in that case, that didn't happen. Zero accountability and a sack resulted. Let's clean this up. a very strong gain of 25. Yeah, when the clock starts, Here's a first perfect. and ten, Texas. Inside the red zone here, they'll look to throw. Let's that is go! Toe-tap Sparks. Casey Sparks there to make the grab. All right. We need one more touchdown for this little girl. We gotta do it. Otherwise, she gonna hit me for life. Over the middle complete. It sparks. And they're able to get this one across the 35. See, I'd love to throw it to my nice boy, but he only took 10 sparks. A gain of 12 and a first down. So, Line of scrimmage, the 37. So first and 10. Off the line. Now back to throw. No, be off the line. Escaping the pressure right. He's going to take off with it. 
That oh. would have broken play, but it ends up being a good play. The scramble goes for 20. How many times have we seen this late in the fourth quarter? Because you know the pass rush is getting after him, and they get upfield, get that great push. And what do they create? Space, and he takes off. And look at this. They get the turnover they needed. It's intercepted. What did I just say? I just said that if they final score, they're back in this game. And look at that. Back to throw. Dancing to his left. And he rifles one incomplete. See now. The way he's throwing the football today, almost a surprise when he doesn't complete the pass do like that. But he needs a few more to get his guys down. Because, uh, well, the way he's throwing it leads him to my goal should he's be going to get those completions. Field goal range. Going We're not. Well, this is We're not. It's We're not. And we got it. And he rolls down long horns. Might be seeing that one on the highlight so shows so tonight. The home run ball here. The how much pressure can the offense handle? We're going to find out. He'll look to throw. Push him, man. Push him. Push him. Push him. Got him. And he can't get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. Protection certainly going to need to be a bit better here on second and 16. Back to throw. He's going to let it fly. Get him. And it is incomplete. Seven seconds remaining. Seven seconds. Let's do this. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. Back to throw. We got, we got pressure on the pressure to pull that one. Now a desperation That's throw deep downfield. And it's incomplete. Let's so their go. final drive comes up empty. And with that, the ball game is over. How about this story? Behind a quarterback who had never taken a snap at a college football game until nine days ago, they are the national champions. Ladies and gentlemen, please turn your attention to the podium at midfield for the presentation of the College Football Playoff National Championship Trophy as we present your College Football National Champions, the Texas Longhorns. Jack Ford, talk about a long shot. And as a man who's known as the quarterback whisperer, and I suggest you trademark that, by the way, um, how are you feeling about your quarterback right now? I tell you, this kid's amazing. He worked around the clock to prepare for this game. i never seen anything like it. And I am so proud of what he's done and under this kind of pressure. Hope all you NFL scouts out there are paying attention, because this kid's special. Come on. You deserve it, son. Congratulations. Coach, this is you. This is great. Thank you. A perfect end to a too short season. You're leaving here a champion. I, 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 it's better than I ever thought it would feel. <laughs> I can't even describe it, really. It's just to be up on this stage, celebrating with these guys. It, it's perfect. It's just perfect. It is a perfect end, but it seems like you put up a pretty good case that it shouldn't be today. How do you feel about that? Hey, I, I think I gave myself a shot. If the NFL comes calling, I'll pick up the phone. But this guy over here, this guy, the trophy man. Absolutely. Isaiah Streets, we are all aware of the loss of your brother and what it took to be here today. But can you tell us in this moment how you're feeling right now? It's a lot, lots of feelings, Taylor. Uh, I made a promise to my brother that I was going to... You know, none of this... None of this would have been possible without this man right here. This dude came into an impossible situation. He's got heart. Love you, man. Hey, I love you, man. This was for you, baby! Yeah! This was for you! Yeah! And let's go! A lot of emotions out on the field tonight. This is what football is all about. About getting hit and getting back up. And as you can see in a season that was characterized by overcoming, 
These guys did just that and won a national championship. Back to you guys.